So, I've got another breakfast option for you guys today. Uh, I love breakfast. Okay, so, ask yourselves, um, you know, some people, they like having a, you know, porridge oats for breakfast. Why? Well, you know, good complex carbohydrates, high in fibre, you know, keep your pull-up along with those kind of things. And you can add loads of stuff to porridge to make it dead nice and tasty. Or, you know, you keep it simple, you keep it light, have some scrambled eggs for breakfast, have some fried eggs, you know, boiled eggs, whatever you want, rich in uh, vitamin D, vitamin B, good for your hair, and of course, very high in protein eggs. So, what I'm going to show you today is combining both, okay, so best of both worlds. I've been doing this for about, this recipe for about, what, three years or something like that, four years maybe, uh, use it all the time, dead tasty, dead satisfying, filling, and I thought I'd like to share it with you guys, okay, so, let's make a move, shall we? Okay guys, step one, uh, tablespoon of olive oil, a non-stick pan, okay, get it nice and warm. Okay guys, 8 grams of porridge oats, here we go. Blend the porridge oats first so they're nice and powdery, you know, nice, nice and smooth. Right, so there's my 80 gram of blended porridge oats, nice and smooth, okay. Okay, so next goes in, next goes in 4 eggs, okay. 4 eggs, but I only used 2 yolks, okay. Preference guys, you can do the recipe without, but I'm putting a scoop of protein in mine, cookies and cream, you know, make it taste a bit nicer, uh, up the nutritional value, get a bit more protein in it, okay? Ingredients are back in the uh, blender, okay, so we're going to blend all the ingredients again together to get a nice pastry. Okay guys, so I've got my mixture, you know, nice and smooth, dead runny, don't be scared to blend it for that little bit longer, you know, so all the ingredients are extra mixed. My pan's nice and warm. Okay, so in goes the mixture. Okay, you're gonna treat it like scrambled egg, basically. Okay, so you're just gonna keep turning it and turning it. Okay, like so. Just keep moving it around. Obviously, make sure you've got a non-stick pan. You know, that's the secret. That's the secret tool in most rep re most recipes. Okay guys, so it's going to look something like that, it takes about 5-7 minutes, you know, keep turning it, turning it, like I said, treat it like scrambled egg, and it should be all like nice and golden, a little bit crispy. Okay guys, so just quickly go over it again, um, you know, very simple to make, porridge oats, eggs, I think I used, yeah, I used 4 eggs, 2 yolks, uh, through 2 yolks, you know, don't too many yolks, you know, plaster and stuff, so yes, 80 grams of porridge oats, uh, four eggs, okay. Scoop of protein powder, you know, if you want to, you know, make it taste a bit nicer. Bump up the nutritional value with your protein, and yeah, mix it all together. Get it on the pan. The whole thing takes about ten minutes. Dead simple, very tasty, very satisfying. Um, I also put some chopped banana, uh, some cinnamon, a bit of peanut butter on mine, and some zero sugar chocolate sauce. There's loads of those kind of things, you know, in the supermarkets these days. Low sugar this, low sugar that. If you guys can see, just there, look, there it is. It's nice, isn't it? Okay, well, I'll do a photo for you guys anyway, so you guys can see it. it should be on our page. Um, yes, so give it a try, guys. See what you think. You know, we can do loads with uh, porridge oats and uh, eggs, can't we? Absolutely loads of stuff. Um, yes, all right, guys, I'll leave you to it. And see you all soon, Mike.